Hello YouTube, Dr. Sol has promised, coming to you from Lagos, Nigeria. So, here is our mystery box. As you can see, it came by FedEx through London Heathrow to Nigeria and it came from China. So here is the year's latest. Um, well, I'll let you see. So as we unbox this, you'll be seeing it about the same time as I see it. So let me take the wrapping off and then I'll show you what the box looks like without the wrapping and then I'll open the box and show you what's inside the box. So I've removed the FedEx packaging and those of you that could zoom will tell what it is before I even show you what it is. It weighs, this sucker weighs quite a bit. Um, I don't really know what the weight is so until I open the um, until I open the box and look at the manual, I can't really tell you what, how much this weighs. I don't know why they have an umbrella there, and why they have a, a glass of wine. You know, I never could understand why they have a glass of wine, or an umbrella on the packaging, but the direction I understand quite well. But the glass of wine, I don't. So let me open it, and then you see it the same time I see it. So here we go. So here it is. So this is Dr. Sola unboxing this mystery surpri surprise inverter, sorry. I'm not doing a very good job because I'm by myself today. And it's showing us, I believe, the mounting bracket. You see that? That's a mounting bracket. So let's remove this. The mountain bracket is interesting. They put it on the back. And, oops, that just fell off. And this I reveal to you folks is there's 12 kilowatt three phase inverter. So this is 12 kilowatts three phase. Looks like all the other inverters, but you can see some differences. I'll bring it out of the box and I'll show you what the differences are. Here is the bracket that allows you to put it on the wall. So let me see if I put that there. By the way, this was, uh, this was purchased by my friend Jack and he sent it to me. He wants me to take a look and then do a video on it. So, Jack, this is your inverter. I'm opening it just now and you're seeing it just as I'm seeing it. So folks, here it is. It is out of his box. And come one, come two, come three grade load and gen look at the size of the battery where the battery cables come out from that thing is huge look at my look at my hand look at how big the thing is and then if you recall we had three cooling tubes one single cooling tube on the five kilowatt this has three of them um one thing also i observe is grab handles i don't know if he has a fan let me see probably does you can see the size of the heat sink the heat sink starts from here and goes all the way to the bottom um, sorry about the lighting. You can't really see the heatsink, but all of this portion, all the way from where this demarcation down, is the heatsink. And then here are our specs um, IP65, 25 minus 25 to plus 60 degrees C. It starts the rate at 45 degrees C. Um, 48 volts, 48, 40 volts to 60 volts. Battery current 240 amps holy shimolis um ac input voltage 360 400 frequency 50 60 hertz but you know this is not going to be 56 it's just going to be one max ac input power 13200 pv input voltage 550 now unlike the others right this seems to go all the way to is that 600 or 800 let me see hold on let me back up i can't see that close with my glasses 800 volts, which is an improvement compared to what we had before. Um, MPPT range is from two, 250 to 620. Wow. Max PV power 16,600 watts. This is a killer. 
Max PV current is 30, I think. And I don't know how many MPPTs, but I'll get that in a jiffy. So on grid mode, I don't need to read all that to you. But this is a 12,000 watt inverter. So it's rated at 12,000 watts. Pretty impressive. Let me open this cover here so you can see what's inside. You have um, three CT clamps. One for each phase. One, two, three. Your Wi-Fi and then your communications cable. And then your screws to secure your Wi-Fi device right here. And then the Allen key to allow me to open these. So let me open it and show you what it, is, what it looks like on the inside. And then I'll end this video. So here is the uh, on and off switch, here is the DC switch turn the PV off. So inside you have your grid, your neutral RST, PE same here, neutral RST, and then same thing for your gen. So what you see is you see extra cables and I'll show you the 5 kilowatts for comparison so you have an idea. Um, look at the size of the battery. Look at the size of the battery terminals, look at the size of those screws. Those things are huge. I mean, they're big. So, here's a look at the Deyer 12 kilowatt, three phase inverter. Folks, you saw it here first at Dr. Solar's channel. Now, let's compare for comparison's sake. Here's the five kilowatt. So, five kilowatt, the 12 kilowatt. The five kilowatt. Of course, we've taken this apart and the 12 kilowatt and you can see they're not even in the same league. This is a monster and this is just a little baby here. And if you look on the inside, you can see fewer, um, fewer terminals for your electricity. Um, this is three here, three here, three here versus one, two, three, four, five each. So each phase and oh, they have separate neutrals. Interesting. So, um, I'm pretty psyched. I'm going to run this sometime this weekend. If I don't run it this weekend, I'll definitely run it on um, I'll run it on Monday. The big challenge that I face is that I do not have um, battery cables that are big enough to fit into this, and at the same time fit into my pylon tack. So what will end up happening is we're going to have to fashion special battery cables just so I can allow or put put a bus bar. So it will allow me to use this inverter with that battery. Folks, I'm pretty psyched. There's so much happening um, at Dr. Solar's. I have another inverter again, another surprise, which is this one. And hopefully sometime next week I'll be showing it to you. Uh, so once this is done, but well, once I'm done with that one, I'll do this one. So for comparison sakes, Look at the two inverters. That's the Deye 8 kilowatt to your left and the Deye 5 kilowatt to your right. And you can see they're just not in the same league. One is just super big while the other is just, you know, normal size. Well, if you like what you see, please give me a thumbs up. If you had to subscribe, please click the subscribe button. Once again, this is Dr. Sola coming to you from Lagos, Nigeria. Let's see. And the tube on this one is right at the top here. I don't know if you can see it.